Okay, so uh, here we go. Our A section we already know. That's that whole deal right there. The B section of the song is going to be uh, this. It's going to start on a B chord. Now you can use a B chord like this, or you can just use a B octave. Whatever you like. So we'll start off with just the regular chord. And it goes to an A suspended, to a G. That whole thing happens twice. The third time we go B. Right there is it as a uh, A inverted. Back to a G one time, and then back to the strum pattern. That's what it is. One, two, three, and four, and 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 even when we go to the in inversion. Uh, there's your B section. So then we have uh, our interlude, which is way down here, 15, 14, 12, 10 all against a pedaling D string. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. So that riff happens four times. Uh, and then we go back to our A section. Then we have the, our C section, which is our bridge uh, kind of feel. It uses five, seven, and nine, all octaves. Very similar, uh, a little different strum actually. We all down strums. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. And then it opens up with the strumming from before. Okay, right there. Uh, and I believe that that is it. It goes back to your A section and we'll walk out on that.